All right, drill in the fill hole for the rooftop shower. First time using this drill press. Here we go. You gonna help me to work, buddy? Yeah. All right, well, let's just pray that this goes right. I'm so, so like that port should be down or something. Based on the YouTube videos I watched, the, um, the dude did a whole saw like I just did and put a two inch clean out insert. But the problem with that is, is you're cutting on a curved, you know, surface. So the hole is gonna be a little bigger. I did see on his video that he did goop it up with a ton of, of uh, ABS cement so maybe if I do the same it'll hold up but I really don't like this I was gonna do it the other way the REI kit way um, or there's a video on how they do it and they just get a T fitting with a four inch four inch and then a like a two or three inch top I thought this would end up looking cleaner, but clearly I was wrong. Anyways, we shall see how it goes. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna let this dry, and I'm gonna add more ABS cement on there, and then see how it holds up. Thank you. But I don't like it. I don't like it at all. And maybe even if I like had cut those a little bit to make it cinch in a little better, but. Yeah, no. You know? It's not gonna... There's no way. It's a huge gap. Stupid. Alright. Uh, put the air fill... Uh, Schrader valve in. to clean up that hole and put the water spout in the uh, spigot and, and the hose will hook right up to that. And we'll have a shower hook up. This is the fill side. Um, this is a quick pressure release so it's a radiator drain plug with a lever I guess. Uh, came from a YouTube video but to fill it just fill that up I need to clean this up I'm really worried about if it's gonna even seal <laughs> um, if not I'm just gonna cut it here and here and add the uh, t-pipe we'll try it out if it starts to leak swap it out all right attempt one let it dry overnight. Probably sand it down a little bit and do a flat black, uh, flat black, bleh, flat black coating for uh, you know uh, solar heating purposes. And then yeah, I added just a whole shitload of clear caulking there just to really hopefully seal it. And like I said, this is attempt one. If it doesn't seal, I'm just gonna cut it out and add the tea there and that should solve the problem. Right, 
First time testing it out. Should be about four and a half gallons, maybe five. I forgot to start recording the second attempt, but first attempt <laughs> based off of the YouTube video was a horrible fail. Air started coming out, the caulking and uh, ABS cement and just didn't hold air, so I went and got this clean out tea. Um, and so, yeah, I'm just gonna try to glue it, and put it, glue it onto there, and then hopefully I can reuse the uh, fill cap that I already made, otherwise I, ha I bought a new one, so just to, I has it back up anyways. See how it goes. Right, got it all filled up with water, no leaks. I pressurized it with a hand pump, no leaks. Now I'm gonna hook up the hose and see if I have enough pressure. If not, I'll just add pressure, see what happens here. Oh, we got pressure. Probably not enough, though. Oh, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. We didn't take showers while we're camping. There's no water. No showers available. See, I just got to add a little more pressure. But we're good. Rooftop. ABS shower complete. 